if you are 21 years or older, it is legal to drink in public on the Las Vegas Strip, as long as you're drinking from an open container, such as a beer can or a plastic cup. It is not legal to drink from a glass container on the Strip. And during New Year's Eve, you can't drink out of aluminum either. The only time it is legal to carry a glass beverage on the Strip is if the container is closed and in a paper or plastic bag with a receipt attached. Even though it is legal to walk the Strip with an open container, you may not drive on the Strip or anywhere in Las Vegas with open containers. Any open containers would need to be placed in the trunk, and if there is no trunk, the glove compartment. You also may not take open containers on the monorail or public buses. However, you usually can take open containers into private taxis and shuttles as long as a transportation company allows it. It is also illegal to possess an open container, one, within a thousand feet of the store from which the liquor, beer, or wine was purchased in closed containers, except on residential property, or two, in any parking lot. If you are cited for violating open container laws on or around the Strip, you face misdemeanor penalties of up to $250 in fines and or up to 30 days in jail, though it's rare for judges to actually impose jail time for a first offense. Note that the drinking rules on Fremont Street are a little different than the drinking rules for the Strip. Any alcohol consumed on Fremont Street must have been purchased at a bar, restaurant, or casino on Fremont Street in a plastic container. Aluminum is never allowed on Fremont Street. Violating this rule is a misdemeanor carrying a fine of about $200 plus court costs. So if you've been arrested for drinking from an open container, call the Las Vegas Defense Group at 702 Defense and we'll talk about ways to get your charges dismissed.